Hi, this is Mike DeLisa from Core Solutions. Today I want to show you how to use connections in CRM. Now you can connect any two entities in CRM. It's wide open. But in my example today, what I'm going to do is take an opportunity and connect it to a contact from another account who is going to help me with this opportunity. So, as you can see, this opportunity is linked to the account record of Heritage Research. And uh, in my notes here, it's clear that Heritage is interested in a Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2013 system. They're going to host it internally. So, we're going to provide those CRM services for them. But in addition, they also need a new server. And they'd like us to help them with the purchase of the server. Now, we're not in the hardware business, but that's okay. I'm going to use connections to link a contact in my CRM database to this opportunity. So I click on the Connections Navigation button. And then I click on the Connect icon in the ribbon. And I'm going to connect to another entity. Now, I want you to notice that when I click the search box, while it currently is taking me to contacts, which is what I'm going to ultimately use, I can drop this down and I can select any entity in my CRM system. Once again, any entity can be connected to any other type of entity. So in this case, I'm going to uh, select my buddy Chuck Delardia, who works at Dell Corporation. He's going to help us uh, put this deal together on the hardware side. And if you want, you can create a pick list for the as this role field which defines what role Chuck is going to play. And you can uh, design and, and uh, use this option set any way you want. I'm going to pick hardware provider from the list. And I'm going to type in a quick note. They will deal with him directly. So we're not going to be involved in this at all other than hooking the two up. So I'm going to save and close that connection. Now, looking on the opportunity, we can see that there is a connection to Chuck Delardia. He's The role is hardware provider, and they will deal with him directly. And if we click on Chuck's contact record, and we go to the connections area on that contact record, we can also, from a different perspective, see that he is uh, associated with, connected to, the web lead opportunity with Heritage Research. So I hope you found this useful. Connections can uh, come in many different flavors. Uh, you can link any two different types of entities. And it's a great way to track cross-relationships in your system. Uh, if you're interested in using connections, please contact us. Of course, contact information will be coming up in just a second. Once again, thanks for watching.